In this video, we will quickly see how to prioritize incident requests in BMC Helix Incident Management. Prioritizing incident requests helps you to resolve incidents in an efficient and timely manner, avoid SLA breaches, and reduce costs for an organization. When you log into the BMC Helix IDSM portal, the home page displays all the log tickets in the left pane. The SLA alert for the incident is also shown. This SLA alert is the time that is due for an incident request to be resolved, and to avoid an SLA breach. The SLA alert is calculated based on the incident's impact and urgency values entered while creating the incident request. A service target is the calculated priority set in accordance with SLAs. Service targets are configured in BMC Helix IDSM Service Level Management Console. Let us consider this incident request that was created 6 minutes ago, and see the different SLAs it goes through. You can see that this incident does not show any warning sign or an SLA alert message too. The incident screen shows the incident created an updated timestamp, a green SLA progress bar, and the next SLA timestamp. A green SLA bar means that the incident is compliant and must be closed within the next SLA timeline to avoid a breach. The SLA bar progresses in accordance with elapsed time, and the indicator bar's color changes as and when the configured service target milestones are met. The incident moves up the list in the home page, and is pinned with the warning icon and an SLA alert message. Here the SLA bar is in orange, this indicates that the incident status is in progress, and the next SLA time is fast approaching. Hence this incident could be prioritized to work on, over other compliant incident requests. If the incident is not closed within the SLA timeline, the SLA bar appears in red indicating that the SLA has breached. The time since the SLA has passed is also displayed. We will now see the incidents in the BMC Helix ITSM UI. Log into the portal using your credentials. Click the incident description in the dashboard or home page to navigate to the incident screen. The incident screen appears with all the details of the logged ticket. An SLA bar appears indicating the SLA status. An orange bar indicates the SLA is in progress and nearing due, and the next SLA date is shown. Now, let us see another ticket that has breached the SLA. Here, the red bar indicates that the SLA has breached, and the timestamp indicates the breach time. Let us now check another ticket that is compliant. We see a green SLA bar, this indicates that the SLA is compliant and the incident was resolved within the SLA timeline. In this way, by viewing the SLA alert status of incidents on the home page of BMC Helix ITSM, you can prioritize the incidents, thereby avoiding SLA breaches. To know more, see the topic reviewing service targets for an incident request available in BMC Helix documentation. To access the documentation, click the link in this video's description. Hope this video helped you understand how to prioritize incident requests to avoid SLA breaches. Thank you for watching.